Hello and welcome to my videos. I'm going to show you how to encrypt a home partition uh, or a home directory after you've installed uh, your Ubuntu. So this Ubuntu uh, is of the 18 series, 18.04 at the moment. Okay, so we're not going to encrypt the install. Uh, and if we look at this uh, part where you're setting it up, and you put in your details in, normally there would be uh, underneath require my password, there would be uh, encrypt my home directory. Okay, so we've installed this system. We're logging in. The first thing we need to do is open a terminal. We need to install a piece of software. In Ubuntu, uh, this isn't installed at the moment. But you can install it quite easily. So it's sudo apt install eryptfs utils u t i l s. That takes a couple of seconds to install. There you go. That's all done. X that off. We need to type in the word user or users and start the user um, program. And we're going to add a user. Give it a name. So something that's, uh, uh, you know, this is just temp test, something, anything you want. Now, when you're making a new user, you can actually encrypt the home folder, which is strange that it doesn't offer it to you at the time when you're installing. Give this new user a password, something nice and easy. And uh, I would generally tick don't ask for password, but if you forget to do that, it's quite easy to, to change that. It's telling you that the password is asked for that logon. Okay, so put your normal password in, authenticate, and then put a tick on don't ask for password at logon. And you see that's changed. Okay, and then in manage groups, we need to click on sudo, sudo, and then give the, your new user sudo rights. Click OK. Close that. And close the user settings. And then we're going to restart the computer. Click on restart. There we go, we've restarted. We're going to log in with the other user, the temp test user. This is the one we've made up. Okay, we we'll see they want to update. Terminal again. And this time it's sudo ecryptfs dash migrate. dash home space dash u space and then the user that you want to encrypt okay put your password in and it'll run through and it'll encrypt that and then the important one here is number two so this is what we're going to do now okay now once we've done this once we've encrypted the home folder what we need to do is log back into that user okay so log out out of temp test and into your main user put your password in and then this update information will come up click on run enter your password that's your normal pseudo password to log in and then you can copy uh, that down keep that safe click close and you set up the encryption on your home. So if we click on uh, File Manager, then go up to above the home structure, your home structure, you can see there's temp test, and this is the folder, the old folder, the unencrypted folder, so that we need to delete these two items, but we can't delete them. It won't let us delete them. Best thing to do then is to go um, 
to help, click about, and then we can see the name of file manager. Okay, so in a, in a terminal again, sudo and thanar, because this is an XFCE password. And then we click on home, and then go up, and then highlight the both folders that you want to delete. So you have to be in sudo, sudo file manager. Okay, so we've deleted those. Go up to users and groups, click on temp test, and delete. Then your normal password, authenticate, and then delete files. Okay, click close, and everything is encrypted now. Okay, so your home is encrypted. What we're going to do, we're going to start um, a live USB, and then we're going to have a look at the home folder. The one we've just encrypted is saying that we can't get into it. If we do it open uh, with administrator rights, what you will see is access to your private desktop. You can't log into that from there. Click on the home, and if we try to open the home, okay, and it won't let you in because the home folder or home partition is encrypted. There you go, that's all done. I hope you enjoyed that. Keep coming back and I'm sure there'll be more videos to look at.